And we begin at 6 o'clock with breaking news and a SWAT situation in Tamarack. Two people found in, dead inside a townhome. The SWAT team finding the bodies once they went inside after a short standoff. CBS 4's Kerry Codd was there, is there live with what he's learned. Kerry. Yeah, Ruta Van Rick, right now the Broward Sheriff's Office is allowing people back into this community off of Woodlands Boulevard, just north of Commercial Boulevard near Rock Island Road. This whole thing began around 1 o'clock this afternoon with reports of a barricaded subject inside this townhome community. A large presence from the Broward Sheriff's Office responded, including the SWAT team. We watched the SWAT team prepare to make entry into this home around 4 o'clock. Everyone in this area heard a loud Bang! People who are, were inside their homes told us it sounded like a bomb went off. Their homes shook at the time. That apparently is when the SWAT team made entry into this townhome. Once inside, we are told they found two people dead. Earlier, the Broward Sheriff's Office told us it appeared to be a man and a woman. At this point, just a few moments ago, they said they're not quite sure about that. All they can tell us right now is that two people are dead. We did speak to one young woman who lives in this community. Here's what she told us. I was scared. I live, I live like over here. You know what I mean? Like these people like live, or this guy like lives in my neighborhood. So it's like we're living with this person. Like what did they do? What are they doing? And again, those are questions that the Broward Sheriff's Office investigators want to figure out as well. At this point, very little information as far as who these victims are, what their potential relationship is. We're hoping to get more information from the Sheriff's Office live in Tamarack, Kerry Codd, CBS 4 News.